healthy is my goal. When I was younger, I think I was more restrictive. It was all about kind of the way I looked. And now that I'm older, I just want to enjoy life. There's something really nice about being able to accept that and really just shoot for health. I think the, your mindset is super important because you can get to the place where you want to be but still feel horrible about yourself. Um, so I think mindset is super important. I probably work out four days a week. I mean, I travel a lot, so when I'm traveling, it's usually a half an hour. I take a jump rope with me everywhere that I go, so it's just easy to do and easy to do body weight workouts. But when I'm home, I have a trainer who I work out with a couple of times a week. We do a lot of body weight stuff. I do lighter weight circuit training, basically. I love Pilates and yoga, and I get really bored, so I have to switch it up a lot to, to keep myself interested. I like food, and that's another reason I work out, because I like food <laughs> and wine. I'm not really restrictive on carbs or anything like that. I'll usually have my carbs in the morning and do oatmeal and fruit, or do some gluten-free toast that's made out of coconut flour, which is so good, um, with an egg. And for lunch, I'll usually do salad and chicken and, you know, the kind of normal stuff. <laughs> I mean, I like my glass of wine at night or my tequila on the weekends. Yeah, that's probably a really bad thing. <laughs> No, it's just, uh, it's something that I enjoy. So, you know, I give myself those moments to have that. So last night, actually, I baked cookies and I was like, I'm not have a photo shoot tomorrow. I'm not really gonna eat this, it's just for the kids. And I find myself like in the bowl going, this is too good not to eat. I mean, it's about health and enjoying life. I do dig into the kids' food, no question. You're never gonna be good enough for it anybody, you know, someone's always gonna have something to say. You know, for me, I've had all of my life like out in the public and I think you just have to know your truth and you have to be able to, to stand in that and shut everything else out. And that's, I think, the healthiest thing to do. So these past few years, I've really kind of been stripping away at that and trying to find what my truth is and being able to project that. And it's so much easier, like there's no trying when that happens. And I, I always know that I'm living in that truth and it's just easy.